So uh, the PRIME study, the Aducanumab trial um, that was recently published, um, was a very exciting study. I think the most interesting aspect is that this immunotherapy for amyloid actually demonstrated that it appeared to be getting rid of the amyloid in the brain of patients with Alzheimer's disease or mild cognitive impairment with evidence of Alzheimer's underneath. Um, so I think that was the most exciting part. There seemed to be a dose response as well, and there was perhaps even some cognitive effects. So for a phase, late phase one trial, it was a very exciting result. The main uh, concern with side effects for this trial um, were the uh, aria or the amyloid associated in, um, edema that you can see in the brain. They were very aware of that for this study and so they did do serial MRIs and for many patients were able to pick it up and adjust the dosing even before patients had symptoms but some patients did have symptoms, headache, confusion, those kinds of side effects. Something that we'll really need to keep an eye on. They also saw a little bit of a genetic effect so people who were ApoE4 carriers, this risk gene for Alzheimer's, had a higher frequency of that side effect. The company is now doing a phase three trial. Biogen is funding the phase three trial for Aducanumab. Uh, we at Cleveland Clinic, in fact, are a site for that trial. Uh, we're particularly interested to see if we can replicate the results. Do we see it impacting the amyloid in the brain? Do we see, in fact, a, an effect on cognition and Alzheimer's? And given the mechanism underlying this, it would be the first drug that we have that actually impacts the disease itself. It's actually disease modifying. So if the trial is positive, it certainly is very supportive of the amyloid hypothesis that amyloid is really one of the main causes of the disease. I think this is the final proof of the theory. If you get rid of the amyloid and you get rid of the disease, then this is pretty strong evidence for that hypothesis. My guess is in the long run, it'll be more complicated than that, but this is certainly a part of the picture and we're all very excited um, to see uh, the results of the phase three trial.